this moment, there's an effort near Little Falls to create the largest ice carousel in the world. Yeah, it is happening on Green Prairie Fish Lake, and they're hoping to have the carousel moving sometime this evening. John Lordson shows us how they're doing it and tells us about the special cause it's benefiting. Mother Nature always, you know, has the commanding hand in the whole deal. But Mother Nature likely didn't plan for Chuck's Willing and his crew. They're using chainsaws to cut one heck of a circle in the ice. And they're not just trying to break last year's Ice Fest record. They want to shatter the world record. We did 111 meters last year. Finland, we, when I went there, Finland did 122. When I went to Maine, they did 130. So we're going to end up at about 100. And I haven't measured exact, but we're at about 153 meters probably. That's about 500 total feet of frozen frigid work. To show you what they're up against, when I put this chisel on the lake and I go to the bottom of the ice and then I pull it back up, the ice thickness is at about 18 inches. But they're getting a hand from a group who knows a thing or two about ice. You don't want the ice to freeze over once you get it, right? Yeah, when we now get, get it spinning, we'll be just spinning it until Sunday. Yanni is an engineer and he's part of a team from Finland who puts their own spin on ice carousels. They're here to help get this one started. Doing ice carousels is all about having fun during winter time and connecting people in, in a positive way. Like last year, when big chunks of ice are cut, they're pushed under and away from the circle. Then they'll attach trolling motors to make it spin. But whether they get it moving or not isn't the most important thing. All the donations for the carousel will help battle child hunger. Because somebody asked us last year, you know, they said, what, do you, what if you fail and you don't set the world record? And, you know, I said, we've already won. Our goal this year is to, to uh, reach $12,000, which would feed all the kids for one year that are on the programs. In Morrison County, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. The second annual Sunny's Willing Memorial Ice Carousel Extravaganza will take place this weekend. There will be hockey and speed skating, among other activities. The event is free. 